Let's go for a ride folks. This is the Tesla Model 3. It's fun to drive. This is a pure electric. It's like ordinary car, but it feels good. It's very smooth. Very smooth. So we're on a busy street. It's all electronics. It's very simple inside. The handling is perfect. It's, the steering wheel is uh, not loose, but it's firm. Uh, no moving, it's uh, precise the direction that you want to go. This is my first time to drive Pure Electric. Pure Electric is the car, I think, I think, <laughs> car of the future. It's very nice. And it is a uh, very, very nice. Everything right here that you can see are all powered by uh, computers. Everything that you wanna go, you wanna do, music, anything, aircon, anything that you can think in the car that already invented in any car are all in here in this Tesla. This is the basic on Tesla. I don't know if you're watching all over the world. What I can tell you is the American version. It's like, uh, I should say, it's like an ordinary median car. The price, but it depends where you are. But uh, all I can tell you, this is the future of the car business. It's very smooth, not only that one, it's a very fast if you hit the acceleration. And uh, I could say it's wow. Wow. <laughs> I love this car. It's a very nice car. Very nice car. I drove a few uh, a nice car before in my life from Mercedes, Mercedes SL, BMW X5, BMW 5 Series, but this is, uh, I think this is more advanced, more excellent, and not only that one. This car, if I'm in a different place, I could uh, have this car get me by remote control with my phone. Let's say I'm in the casino. I'm in Las Vegas. Let's say I'm in the casino. I would like to be home. I just remotely dial it and this car will get me. This car, they call it autonomous car. Here in Las Vegas, at the Uber are no driver some of them not all but in about two to three years possible less human driver it's all like autonomous By the way, this is just a test drive <laughs> <laughs> I don't own it yet okay please believe me this is just a test drive uh, if we like it, it's probably we will order it. But for now, I would like to check if this car is for me. See the acceleration? <laughs> very smooth. Very, very smooth and I should say wow. Mm -hmm. Anything music, you can pull up, you can connect your phone. Uh, FM only, don't have AM radio, in case you listen to that. If you have a Spotify account, you just put it straight in there. So on a standard range plus, you'll have uh, 30 days of connectivity before it's a $10 a month subscription. Not too bad. And what that includes is this uh, streaming service, um, you get the 
with YouTube, or I'm sorry, not YouTube, but with Google Maps, you've got the satellite view as well as live traffic update. Is this movable ladder down or up? Or no, uh, uh, it stays fixed. It stays fixed there, huh? Then you can always find your supercharging network as well as regular destination chargers. So Let's say fun. going LA, how many charging stations I can hit you before LA? you got four different ones um, on the main highway. Once you get into the city, you've got a lot. quite a few. I see. So it's calculating out right now when to make your stop. So it looks like Barstow is going to be your first one. Mm -hmm. um, if you wanted to stop before then, just tapping on here and you can see the rest of your network. Wow. In real time, it's showing how many people are at that location at this time. And you can just navigate directly to that one. This is how much you're getting charged per kilowatt. By the way, how much uh, per kilowatt uh, in a charging station? I need... Average about 27 uh, cents to 35 cents. Per? It just kind of depends on which one you go to. I see. Let's say uh, halfway, how much it would cost? Uh, for me to uh, have it charged. So if you multiply that number, that 35 cents times 75 kilowatts will give you from overall. But right here, what it's showing on your navigation, mm -hmm. if we were to go, you're gonna uh, 20 minutes and then you're gonna have a full charge. I see. And that is uh, 35 cents you said? 35 cents, multiply that by times and you'll get about how much you'll be charged for that. All right. So it's cheaper than gasoline, huh? About a fraction of the cost. Yeah. Nice. So, that, so this one has the full self-driving, so you're able to navigate on autopilot. It's going to do the lane changes and everything for you. So the 2020 in this model, you can also self-navigate this uh, this car. If you purchase, be capable of that. Um, it's just adding that feature in if, yeah. you, bu if you buy it. It's How much a month for that one? $10,000 more? $10,000. I see. Well, I'm not into it yet. <laughs> and that's all right. You can always add it on later. It's just a I software see. update. All right. Nice to know.